Kiwi scientists have completed a world first in a daring mission inside the crater of Mount Erebus in Antarctica. They've successfully extracted one of the rarest and oldest living organisms on Earth, which might hold answers to some very current problems. Patrick Gower is with the scientists in Antarctica and filed this report. Mount Erebus, Antarctica. And these Kiwi scientists heading for its crater. This is discovery science at its best. It's really to discover uh, new life under new conditions. Professor Craig Carey of Waikato University leading this quest. It is adventure crossed with science. It's the southernmost active volcano you know, with an active lava lake in the middle and Strombolian explosions. Mount Erebus was of course known for the Air New Zealand crash back in 1979 that killed 257 people. Now, here in 2023, it is the scene of one of our most advanced and adventurous scientific expeditions. How life evolved, not just on this planet, but could be how life evolved on other planets. The scientists are hunting some of the rarest living things on Earth. We found um, organisms that are growing deeper into the tree. Um, and that's incredibly exciting because when we do that, we can kind of see where life came from and how it has evolved to what we see today. Microbes are organisms that are too small to be seen without using a microscope. The ones inside Erebus are as undisturbed as you can get. They date back 100,000 years. The primary purpose of this is to explore and identify mechanisms that these bacteria are using in order to live in this unique environment. A rock sample taken off the mountain and the microbes successfully extracted in Antarctica New Zealand's lab at Scott Base. The aim now to understand how the microbes work, the powers that they have to survive, which could hold answers to some of the world's biggest problems. Try to use that to help us solve some of our human derived problems. World leading science at the edge of the world. Patrick Gower Antarctica News Hub.